Hello everyone, my name is Jamie from UT Austin. My presentation today will be on reachability-based trajectory optimization for robotic systems, especially given context sequences. When we control the complex robotic systems like a humanoid robot, we have to consider multiple issues. First, full body dynamics is nonlinear. Sometimes we use linear inverted pendulum model for the planning. Second, most of robots have physical joint position, velocity, and torque constraint. Third, we consider kinematic constraint for the contact and friction range cone constraint. Um, we focus on the discrepancy between the planning and control models. For the local manipulation, we plan the center of mass trajectory and full location with the TBR planner. However, we don't know the planned result can be reproducible for, by full body robot due to the constraint. So we propose a method to check the planned full location is reachable or not and to optimize the trajectory for the whole body controller. In our previous work, we just planned the center of mass trajectory and full location using TBR planner and generate swing foot trajectory using smooth interpolation like a B spline or cubic spline. And trajectories of center of mass and foot are controlled by whole body controller. However, this paper proposes an additional part consisting of kinematic visibility test reachability analysis, and optimal control for modifying the trajectory. Uh, also, we propose a method for obtaining forward and backward reachable sets in terms of the given contact mode. These methods are based on the sample-wise optimization. For computing the forward reachable set, we draw random input samples satisfying the input constraint and solve the QP to obtain the joint acceleration. The initial state is propagated forward using this solution. Also, we can obtain the backward reachable set by drawing joint velocity samples satisfying the constraint. Then, we check there is a pair of input and contact force in the optimization problem. If yes, we can propagate the state backward. Otherwise, we discard this sample. Based on the computed reachable set, we can test our states are reachable or not over a finite time horizon. Then we solve the formulated optimal control problem to generate a trajectory to change the contact mode. As a result, we can modify our uh, foot trajectories for the whole body controller. These are numerical simulation results. We employ the same TBR planner and the same whole body controller. Without the proposed method, the TBR planner produces the diverging foot location. However, the proposed method can make more stable working due to the optimized trajectory. Let me briefly sum up the main contributions here. Thank you.